but I think uh, right now Barcelona is a place uh, where you find artists from all over the world uh, moving here and painting and I think there's a lot of creativity uh, around. Uh, it's a place where Picasso grew up and uh, Jean Miro, uh, great painters. Uh, uh, it has a lot of artistic culture. Um, so I think Barcelona is a place really to experience right now. It's my new favorite city, definitely. It's uh, just the people here, I think, are so fun and nice. They're really warm. They kind of have a, I don't know, it's just a, it's just a happy feeling that you get here. I wish I could be back there right now. <laughs> it was it was gorgeous and it had nice history to it, but it, it still had the hustle and bustle that was similar to being in New York. So it wasn't like there was a hard transition. A lot of the people in the program kept saying they thought they were gonna end up in a city where they were gonna need some adjustment time and it literally felt like in three hours you understood the beat and the culture of the city and you were going in. We already, um, uh shot uh, portraits in the studio, uh, which was uh, uh, one light technique and really um, focusing on psychological portrait. And I had students actually shooting each other so we can have a, a full portfolio of all the participants in black and white. Great opportunity for the first date for everybody to get to know each other and know their story. And it's a preparation for them to shoot later a fashion as a team so they can function better together and they're comfortable with each other. We have a wonderful uh, location uh, in the center of Barcelona, very antique apartment with uh, daylight and uh, beautiful terrace. It was an amazing uh, uh, penthouse apartment. Uh, it was uh, just an amazing place. Uh, everything was perfect. We're going to industrial zone of Barcelona to get something more urban fashion looks. We're going to shoot on this terrace right here in the hotel, which is a really fantastic antique hotel uh, that was uh, actually a private house at one, at one time. Uh, there's a great salon uh, from 1600s uh, over to 1800s with time, uh, so we're going to use that. They will be going to uh, Sitges, which is a um, town uh, on the beach, one hour from Barcelona, uh, where the light is quite beautiful and uh, we'll be shooting uh, on location uh, more swimwear and maybe beauty and uh, a different architectural style of uh, uh, the village. It was a gorgeous, gorgeous thing once we got there. So we were on top of this church area, the church is next to us, and the church happened to be having actually a wedding. So you had all these people surrounding you, and vibrant colors, confetti was going up in the air. It was a gorgeous scenario. To see a progress of a student that maybe didn't know very much about light and how to work with models the first day and see at the end especially the critique, I'm always very impressed with the portfolio and see professional work shown. To me it's pretty amazing what a progress uh, a person can make. And I think I get a lot of appreciation from students because they realize that really they made an enormous progress.